Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, CT5K here, and today we are going over how to build the RPC-2. So as in the showcase video, I will be using this checkerboard to build it out just to give you a sense, like just a sort of reference, so in case something goes wrong, you can always look back and make sure you build this in the right area. So these are all of the materials that you will need to build the RPC-2. Now, first off, we're going to be building the ALU, which is very similar to the RPC's ALU, in which it follows the similar structure. However, instead of just leaving it like this, we're going to come over here and add this line, like so, and this is the multiplier for register 1. Don't forget to add these blocks here. Then we'll add the torch, and then we will add the command lines. Once we have that done, it's time to build the decoder. We will come over here and build a line of yellow wool eight blocks wide. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight blocks wide. And then we will run this along with repeaters. Run along line of dust. Then a block with dust on top of it. And then cover everything with yellow wool. Then we will add torches along this bottom row and also cover them up with wool. Then we will add more repeaters, more redstone dust, and more torches. I will say when you're building this, make sure you set these top registers, well these top repeaters, to two ticks, otherwise your build will glitch. Once we have that done, it is time for ALU busing. So we're gonna come over here and begin by connecting this to decoder one. So we will act, so we will build this, move up a block, and then form a line of redstone that goes right there. The reason this block is higher than everything else will be explained later on in the video. Now we will add the redstone wiring to connect it. And then it is time for us to move on to the knot gate right here. So the knot gate is going to be like this. Then place a block here, followed by a slab, dust, repeater. And then directly over onto the knot gate. Now it is time to build the controller for the multiplier. So we'll be building a flip-flop, which will be like this, followed by a comparator, and then a block, torch, and dust. Now you can add a block in here, like so. Um, this automatically turns it on. I would recommend this be off just so that everything is off when the RPC is first used. To connect to the decoder, we will need to place a block here so that redstone wiring won't get interfered. Place a block here, here, and one here. Then we'll add a repeater here and two redstone dust here and here. Now it's time for building the input registers. So this is similar to the RPC1, except that this register looks the exact same as this one, instead of this one being inverted from this one. So we will come along and break this block because it won't be needed, and then we will build the registers. Then we will add the comparators. And then we will add redstone dust here, 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 and here. Now we will set these two to subtraction mode, add this dust here, and the repeater. Next up is, you guessed it, repeater busing. So we will come and place two repeaters here, and then set this one to subtraction mode, block on top, torch, and dust set to decoder five. Decoder four will have this weird setup that enables us to wipe register one and register two. 
Now, the reason this does not have its own allow is because I was not able to figure out a way to get it to work with inside this small space. While we're at it, let's just go ahead and add a quick input line that goes from this to right here. Now it is time for output busing. So we will place this here, comparator, block, and then we will build a register right here. Then we will make a small tap and build another register inverted from this one. And then we will have another tap right here. Output busing is really simple. And so we will create, we will turn this to subtraction mode, this to subtraction mode, and this to subtraction mode. Then we will add a dust here, followed by a redstone line that goes from here to here. Torch, redstone dust on top. And then we will have a block like this, followed by a redstone line that goes straight to decoder 3. Now decoder 2 gets very interesting, especially since we will be need to go under this circuit right here. So we will go three blocks out with a repeater, two dust, also convert this to a block and repeater. Now we will go under this, add a repeater, add the block back on top, and then create this as a torch circuit that goes right here. The fourth register actually has nothing to do with the decoder, so we will turn this to subtraction mode and add a dust here, and then add a repeater followed by a redstone line that goes right there. To create the output port, it's really simple. Add a comparator here and here. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you build the RPC2. If you need any further help, please contact me on Discord. The link to my Discord server will be in the description. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you do, please consider liking and subscribing. Subscribing is completely free and helps me out a lot. I'm going to be doing some more redstone videos, including how to build the Hydro 1004, which is my redstone long-term memory, and a general video on how to build hex computers in Minecraft. Thanks so much for watching and have a fantastic day.